Hey guys, it's John Callum from KHL Motorsport and I am here with you at KVI Quick Lube. If you don't know what KVI Quick Lube is, uh, it is your quick service automotive center uh, in the, located in the Sukat Parniak area. Uh, KVI Quick Lube offers tires, wheels, batteries, and of course, lubricants like what you could see here today. So this is just one of the product lines as far as lubricants is concerned that uh, KVI Quick Lube carries. Uh, right now, we are featuring the Petron line of motor oils, lubricants, and other specialty products for uh, automotive and motorcycles as well. Uh, but right now, what we have right now is the RevX line of motor oils. Because there's so much variety of motor oil and we want to make, uh, hopefully this would be a series to tell you guys the different different types of motor oil, uh, various varieties, viscosities, ratings, uh, certifications and whatnot. So my aim right now is to tell you and to discuss with you uh, about diesel motor oil, the various things that you need to know and also the feasibility of using diesel engine oil in gasoline engines. I don't know if you guys know if that uh, Lots of diesel motor oils in the Philippines are very compatible with a certain or a majority of gasoline engines uh, available. So we're going to highlight it now uh, using the Petron Rev X line of uh, lubricants. Okay, the Rev X line from Petron is a diesel motor oil specifically marketed for diesel engines. So what we have for you right now is uh, two variants of the RevX series. There's, I think, a few more, uh, but uh, currently in the shop we have... This is the RX400. This is a premium multigrade mineral-based oil. Uh, 15W40 API uh, CI4 and SL. And of course, we have the fully synthetic uh, Petron RevX RX800. It is a 5W40... CJ4 SM motor oil. I'd like to share with you guys what is the API ratings, all right? So API, if I'm not mistaken, means American Petroleum Institute. They are the ones that set standards, uh, industry-wide standards for the quality of motor oils that go into the engine. So there are two separate uh, uh, grading systems, one for gasoline, one for diesel engines. Because gasoline and diesel engines, while both of them are reciprocating piston-style engines, uh, the manner of combustion necessitates a different standard for each. There are oils that are uh, completely just for gasoline, and there are motor oils that are completely just for diesels, depending on the manufacturer and how they want to rate the uh, motor oil. So let's say, for example, let us divert, right? Uh, the Hyundai Exterior G700 is uh, only for gasoline rated API SP, as you can see here. Uh, while the Total Quartz 9000 is only just for diesel engines, it's rated uh, CI4, fully synthetic. All right. The motor oils here of RevX that you could see over here, uh, these motor oils are both, are both for gasoline and diesel for this one, this is CI4, meaning this is compatible with uh, diesel engines that are like already uh, more of the more modern ones, uh, CRDI ones, especially from the early 2000s. Um, and also, this one is also rated SL. When you say SL, this, are, this is also rated for gasoline engines, mostly in the 90s uh, and up. Even for the RevX, R800, this is also compatible for both gasoline and diesel engines. This is rated CJ4. So this is uh, close to the latest standard uh, of uh, diesel motor oil. Uh, and it's also rated SM. So it's, SM is also compatible with engines late 2000s and uh, early 2010s. So because the SP is the latest specification, uh, like Hyundai XT right here. Uh, this has the SP rating. So this is the latest standard. My proposal uh, to you is that you should uh, definitely consider diesel motor oil in your gasoline engines. Why? It's because diesel motor oils are uh, more built to withstand the intense pressures that are uh, extant in 
uh, diesel engines. Remember that diesel engines are uh, fired via compression ignition, meaning they have no spark plug. That necessitates the air fuel mixture to be exploded or to be burnt just by sheer compression alone. So that is a very intense pressure that you need to do to squish the mixture to auto ignition. So that necessitates a very heavy duty engine. So if you if you'd notice, if you'd ever opened up a diesel engine, it's very beefy inside. And it really needs to be very beefy in order to withstand uh, the combustion of the compression ignition uh, strategy. And therefore, since it is a very intense high pressure environment diesel engines require are also a very specific and high pressure capable l uh, lubrication such as a diesel specific motor oil gasoline engines don't necessarily require that uh, that the quality of diesel motor oil uh, allows you to do is will definitely benefit you uh, when you are using your car in extreme duty applications such as guys racing and playing around with their cars uh, so that's why for certain enthusiasts in the Philippines, they really prefer using diesel motor oils in their older 90s, early 2000s cars. The Petron Rev X series of motor oils are very capable and compatible with the gasoline engine standard. So this is also SL rated, uh, this uh, 15W40. It's not far off from the typical 90s oil 20W50 uh, viscosity. So this is slightly thinner. But it's pretty uh, close enough to that one to enable you to get enough protection that otherwise would be a bit lost when the viscosity is less uh, thicker than it should be for the older cars. And uh, if your car requires a bit uh, of a thinner motor oil, if it's newer, uh, your engine manufacturer specifies, let's say 5W30, 5W40, uh, I would then recommend this one for your more modern car. Because this is SM rated. So this is very, very compatible with uh, newer cars, early 2000s, late 2000s, uh, early 2010s level of cars. And uh, don't have to worry about whether or not this would harm your engine. Definitely it won't harm your engine because this, uh, even though they are marketed to be diesel engine oils, they are also compatible compatible for gasoline engines you don't believe me we have used this exact motor oil in our rally car and it has served us very well very strenuous 500 kilometer rally held over two days traveling land traveling from uh, our home base in Paranaque all the way to Subic and land traveling back while rallying five ta 500 kilometers around Subic and Bataan. So that's about a thousand kilometers. And take note guys, it has a relatively modern 1NZ engine uh, made circa 2001, 2002, 2003. So we use this one on the 1NZ engine and uh, the RX400 RevX seems to be very protective of our engine and we I, we did not experience any uh, mechanical issues with relation to lubrication or the engine oil. So I really highly recommend this one, uh, especially if you're budgeted. Uh, in KVI Quick Lube right now, as the videos made, this is 250 pesos a liter. While this one is 480 pesos a liter because this is fully synthetic. These are the lineup of Petron Rev X motor oils and I hope that you would consider having your oil changes done at KVI Quick Lube, your source for tires, wheels, batteries, and lubricants, and your quick service needs in the Sukat Paranaque area. So I'll do share in the description a link to KVI Quick Lube, um, and I'll also dictate to you uh, our Facebook page. It's facebook.com slash kvi.quiklube. So... Once again, this is John Callum from KHL Motorsport. I hope you guys learned a little bit about lubrication and motor oils. And uh, we'll continue with the series, uh, hopefully, hopefully featuring other lubricants and other products that KVI Quick Lube offers. So anyway, guys, see you guys on the next video. Ciao.